it's Disney Girl back for another episode of my Disney's Magic Kingdoms game. So I just logged in and it says striking gold. Accept this magical reward for achieving rank 962 on the leaderboard with a score of 115. So I got 1250 Winnie the Pooh coins. Sweet. Now time to open my daily amber chest here. So let's see what I got inside today. I got 15 magic, red star fabric, and red star fabric. Nice. All right, into my treasure bank I go, but before I was able to, it says hop to the costume shop for a special Easter costume. So for a limited time, you can dress up in Easter costumes for Pluto, Mickey, Minnie, and Goofy. All right, so now into chess, and don't forget that Aladdin is still available in the legendary chess for nine days and 20 hours left. All right, so I got two bronze chests to open. So in the first one, I've got one happiness, 116 magic, and a hanging lantern. All right, now let's see what I got in the next one. One happiness, pirate flag, and a wooden heart bench. Sweet. So two bronze chests are up now. And I'm going into characters, and I am bringing back Tigger into my kingdom, who was leveling up. So here he is. He's so bouncy. Tigger is now level five. There's lots of wonderful things about Tiggers, and this one is one of them. All right, we got some gems too. Sweet. All right, now over to Merlin here, who is going to use the gathering spell for me and gather all my magic and Winnie the Pooh tokens and all of that kind of stuff in my kingdom. Woo, yay. Great. Oh, I clicked it again by accident. No, we're done with you, Merlin. We are done. Okay, now to collect from my characters. All right, so if we look here at the tree, the tree that has been causing us trouble because Pooh Bear has been stuck um, and his rear end has been hanging out the tree right about there. And um, so I had a few comments from some people and they told me that the reason why Winnie the Pooh isn't there anymore is he's fallen into the tree. Um, so apparently he's not stuck anymore unless he's stuck in the tree somewhere but um, yeah so that is pretty intense so Pooh Bear is not hanging out the tree anymore that must mean that we are very close to welcoming him in fact I have everything except for the 15,000 coins so I'm very close, I'm less than 3,000 off, but that means that I need to do some more collecting. Now I still have a few characters left, but I don't think that they will um, give me the currency that I need here in order to um, be able to welcome him right now. But I should have him by my next video if all goes well. So. I am really, 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 really excited about that. My happiness is good in the kingdom. Things are really starting to turn around here. All right, so um, I'm going to hop into my characters again and take a look here and see. So I can level up Rabbit for four hours. Um, or else I can level up Eeyore for six minutes. So I'm going to choose to level up Eeyore. 
and in the meantime I have got to collect from my parade floats so if we can see here that um, I have quite a few um, parade floats but I don't have very many slots so I chose not to buy any slots but um, I think that right now I would like to add another one um, just because I've got 293 gems and I think that um, as soon as this event is over I'm going to probably need to anyways because I've got the Sleeping Beauty that I could invest in, the Wally, the Monsters Inc which would be helpful um, for, well most of them are magic except for Monsters Inc and then uh, I guess no, oh, I guess most of them actually are gems. It's really only two, Wally -E and Sleeping Beauty. Okay, so um, pretty much what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use 55 gems here. Oh, I hate to see my gems go, but I must do it. All right, so that means I have got an extra float that I can assign. You know what I think I'd like to do is buy the Sleeping Beauty one. I know I haven't started the collection for that yet, but just in case when it comes available, can I assign it? It's not, oh right, because I need to collect from it first. So I have an additional slot. I have now purchased um, an extra one, so I don't, oh yeah, it'll let me assign now. Okay, so I'm going to assign Sleeping Beauty because I want to see that one next time the parade float comes out. So I'm super duper excited about that. Okay, so now to collect, apparently I have some more characters here that just came available. So we've got Rue's Ears Hat and Kanga's, which is really awesome. So actually that now puts Rue two away for the ears hat and three away for the family picture. Um, Kanga still needs a few more items. Now how's Piglet doing? Piglet still needs just two more ears hats. So I'm gonna send Cinderella because she can find me some Winnie the Pooh tokens as well for that. Um, we have little Abu here who I'm gonna send for 60 minutes. He just finds magic but um, Let's see, Tigger. Uh, that's in him for an hour, that's okay. I'll be back around to collect and he'll get me um, some Winnie the Pooh tokens a little bit faster. All right. All right, Mickey, so how is he doing in terms of the costume here? I'm gonna send him for 60 seconds and head over to the costume shop to go ahead and take a look to see um, how I'm doing with that. I must be getting close. All right, eight more blue, um, blue moon fabric, and wow, only three more red. All right, so that is awesome. I think I might be able to collect it um, very soon. Maybe not for my next video, but maybe for the, the following one after that. So that will be really, really exciting. All right, so Mickey is going to be sent for, um, I guess, eight hours because that will collect one of the red star fabrics for me. Um, yeah, let's see here. Sending my characters for shorter times, guys, just so you know, the reason why I'm kind of doing that is because you get higher rewards for the shorter times. So like, for example, Jesse for six minutes, if as long as I'm gonna be around, that gets me seven, right? And 60 minutes gives me 10. So realistically, if I do, you know, two six minutes, 
which is also 12 minutes, I guess, of actual work, then that's actually worth more than the 60 minutes. So I'm gonna do the six minutes because even if I'm done the video, I might just um, add a little bit more um, of the Winnie the Pooh coins to the kingdom. So yeah, I know that I'm not collecting for the tokens um, for the characters to level up, but I think I'm kind of at the point right now that that's, I'm okay with that. I know I spent a little bit on leveling up Eeyore, but I'm actually, again, like I'm fine with that. I still have time, so I want to kind of use that time to be able to collect um, from my, uh, collect more of the items or whatever for the characters, even when the event is done. So it'll, it'll just be helpful. So here we go, Eeyore's coming back. Very slowly. Eeyore is now level three. Well, I guess this is just the thing, isn't it? Have you ever been sitting by the riverside, keeping to yourself when a very loud somebody bounces you into the water? I have, on my birthday. Shouldn't have expected anything better, I suppose. At least I got to go swimming all of a sudden. Better get back in the lake again, now that I think of it. If anyone wants to bounce me in, it'll save them the trouble. Wet blanket, send Eeyore to float in the river. Wow, that does sound super emo. So off Eeyore goes for four hours. All right, so I'm gonna send Pluto for 12, cause he can, I'm fine with that. Um, so I should buy, um, Let's see, I should be able to collect Winnie the Pooh with uh, still two days to spare, so that will be awesome. Um, it is definitely doable in the event to collect all of the items, and this is my first official event that I have done the whole entire thing, or will have done. Um, once I am done that, guys, I am going to start doing uh, some videos uh, for Fantastic Beasts, so stay tuned for those. I'm really excited to give that game a try. Uh, I haven't done that one before, so it looks really fun though. It's like, it's one of those games where you search for items and different things, and I, again, I don't know a lot about it, but uh, it looks like it's going to be lots and lots of fun. I have a chest here, and it is a bronze one. Sweet. All right, now let's go take a look before I sign off. Let's take a look at Eeyore here. He's floating in the river. So that opens up um, a section of land that I'm actually kind of wondering now if I should devote to Winnie the Pooh. So I'm wondering if Winnie the Pooh should maybe be in my opening section here or else right over in this area. Um, I already have a uh, rabbit's house that is in this area, but I think that I might like to, um, maybe once the event is over, move all my attractions around stuff. I'm gonna clean up the kingdom to make it look a lot better, but I almost forgot that I have enough magic today to open up the, um, open up this area of uh, the cursed land that I have been trying to for pretty much the whole entire event. So I was able to save up over 350,000 magic to expand the kingdom and clear the curse. So that's gonna take a whole day. But guess what guys, it is totally worth it. And again, I've been saving up. So um, this, like normally I probably wouldn't have been able to save up that much um, just cause I probably would have spent it on leveling up characters, but the event has given me the possibility to uh, the option to do that so that is really really exciting so next video should be a really really big one um, we've got 
Pooh being welcomed, possibly the Sorcerer's costume for Mickey. We've got a new area of Cursed Land. Um, we've got Eeyore, who um, is currently floating around in the river right there. Um, also, too, I might change up a little bit of stuff in my kingdom. If not, then I might combine that if uh, Mickey Sorcerer's costume isn't available. I'll end up moving my kingdom around maybe with that. Just... Uh, because I think it'll be pretty exciting. So we will see. There's lots of stuff that will be happening in my kingdom. So stay tuned for Disney Girl's next video where I will be welcoming Winnie the Pooh before the Honey Tree Troubles event is over. So thanks for watching and we will see you guys for the next episode. Bye!